got how uppers, left fronts. These are probably original OG. This is what they look like when you buy them off Rocket's website. Did you not bring the tape measure with you? You said it on that. Well, why'd you move it back there to stand in front of it? I mean, good lord. Yeah. No answer for that to you. No excuses. Eleven and three quarter. Upper. Well, I've got to go get the paper. You wanted this. Here, take that. Well, meanwhile. You said bring that over. <laughs> well, you needed to you bring everything. What did you expect? So, this car is supposed to have the wide right front option. I don't know if you guys can see the extra bolt holes right there. We're assuming that's what that is. Since I got you in here, shed a little light on the subject. We did notice something of concern. This is our first chance. You guys will get to go with us here. I've been doing a horrible job filming and moving around under the car. Get all up in here. And we found a little something something here. We're not so super satisfied with. This is uh, concerning right here. This is probably why they sold this car. So we were going to have to figure out what we're going to do about that. Uh, I foresee it's just fixing it instead of replacing it. I think it can be fixed. So this whole side will get disassembled. Probably have to do a little bit up here to clean all this up. Somebody's been in here before. This car has supposedly been updated that rocket, but we don't really know. You know how that is. All right, I'm gonna pass you off to Drew here. Here you go, Drew. That's confirmed. That is cracked all the way through. Even on the front side. More flex. Yeah, it looks like somebody tried to fix it here and the weld just didn't take. They didn't get it hot enough. It just beat it up on top. That's what that line is there that I saw yesterday. Right. So basically just need to get in here and grind this, grind all this, leave this bolt in there so we don't get any weld splatter in there. And we'll just make a big V channel in there and we'll get the welder turned up just right. And we'll just fix it and uh, I think it'll be fine. We gotta record some footage. We gotta get something going here. We did all this work and everybody likes our little project, so we haven't mm. shown anybody the destruction and the construction. Yeah, it's just kind of mocked in there for right now. Well, it looks good though, I feel like. Yeah. I'm sure there'll be some comments about it, but that's okay. We have built several of these. This will be the third one. We've not had one break yet. Drew flipped one over and it was just fine. Look, it's still in great shape. There is the cell. Nothing happened to it. So, uh, as we were joking around before we started filming, the uh, this is in, but we got to level it up. We got to grind off some of the nasty, or we basically remade this cage uh, kit to fit this car. And one inch too wide one or one inch too short one inch too narrow <laughs> however you want to put it all the way around for it to fit in the uh original cage that came with the fuel cell here so tonight's project probably just uh try to get it in here how we want it and mark it and drill some holes for mounting pull it out clean it up it's about uh, 10 degrees outside so i don't think we'll be painting it <laughs> at least not right now it's too cold <laughs> Oh, 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 there we go, I got it, I got it. All right, you got a silver marker or anything? No, of course not. It's out, I think. It's a, I saw it somewhere. Here, paint marker. That's good, that'll work. Gotta bring our cameraman over. 
So I think we need to shift it towards the back here a smooge. And you did an excellent job in the front, front to back leveling. I know. That's what I aim for. I mean, please. Hey, I found a silver mark too. Hey, you know what? That's great. Why don't you use that to write on something silver? All right. How's that look in the back there? Just going to uh, lick it and stick it. Are you sure you want to lick it and stick it? You think what maybe we ought to like what? put a the angle finder on here and then set it on here and at least get that the same. I mean, I realize the whole cage is not. It just is what it is. I mean, does this look level with this? Not really. It looks pitched to the right and it looks pitched nose forward to me. So, I mean, you're going to have some slop in your holes to some degree. Well, yeah, I know it's not going to be perfect, but we get one chance to, we're not going to make humongous holes. We get one chance to get what? this thing PFC and that's it. I mean, it looks all right to me. You can, I mean, if you want to get it, get it. Yeah, I'm going to get it. It's in that Makita bag, isn't it? Now, you remember how this thing works, right? Uh, no. That is a negative. It says, err. Point, uh, whoa. Point three. Point two. Point one. It's probably cold. <laughs> Probably either. Yeah. I mean, what is? I know it's settling in there. It's probably closest to that. Yeah, point one. Point seven. Half a degree. Half degree down bubble. This can go up. That makes it worse. Yep. Now do it. Now let's do our right to left pitch here. I see that. Point four. Gotta get it really settled in. Point four. Two point five. Yeah. That's that's oh that just screwed everything up I bet. I should not have done that. No, I don't think everything moves. I mean I think you're gonna have to ultimately probably come down on the jack here. Go a little bit more, just for right now. There you go, that's good, that's good. This one's slipping over here. Oh, God. What is going on here? We need you to take that loose. It's killing it me over there. It no, I need it off. Because it's not letting me change the pitch. There we go. 
So what does that tell us? What? That tells us that the pitch is going to be whatever it's going to be when we tighten the bolts down. So I think we should worry less about the right to left and more about the front to back. Do you agree? Yeah. All right. Great. You just set her on down. Yeah, should be fine. Pull that jack. There she goes. I'll blame that on you. What you distracted me. I wasn't even around you. Mm -hmm. When you did that. that. That was the last That's one. That's what I'm saying. Look what you did. Area. I'll just, I'll just look at all this free area before you came. I'm pretty sure I was going to work hard on making that free air. But you know, I'll, I'll let you hold credit because you kept it clean for like at least a week now, which is way better than I could ever keep any shelf in my house clean. What did you say? Time lapse. Oh, we can turn on time lapse. Oh. And let her, oh. Oh. California. Let, yeah, I was like, yeah, don't let California see that. All right, let me get you guys caught back up. We got our holes drilled. Drew did the uh, world's worst job of grinding everything down. Got everything wiped off. Looking all right. It is, uh, as I mentioned before, it's roughly 10 degrees outside. And we're gonna do something completely, totally and stupid. And we're gonna go out here and try to paint it with this cheap paint. And that way we can continue to move forward with our project. Probably gonna set it in front of that heater down there to get the paint to set and maybe get her stuck back in there. I don't know, it's getting kind of late. Drew had to get his bald head covered up so it doesn't freeze when we go outside. Yeah, uh, it's like two degrees off. All right, here we go. We're going out there, oh boy. We'll have some black snow after we're done with this. This might be our dumbest idea to date. It's only the beginning of the year. <laughs> Come on, boss. What are you doing? <laughs> what were you doing over there? Where are we gonna set this? Out here in the grass? That's probably the best idea. It's gonna have snow on it. How are we gonna do it? Are we just gonna sit here and hold it in the air? Don't set it down, it'll be all wet. Look at this. I can't wait to get this on film. Here we are. It's 10 degrees outside. We're holding this thing in the air while Drew's painting it. Looking good. You're doing great. This oh, old, that paint has got to be freezing. It's not like you gotta paint the whole thing. Right. Switch. Get the uh, back sides of the towers there. There you go. Looks good. Yep. Oh, well, you know, Mr. Call should have been a painter. No. Oh, uh oh, 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 so we got the fuel cell painted, put her in the uh, micro burn here, dried her up. Tomorrow we are going to uh, clean up the fuel cell and uh, install this. And then uh, tomorrow, I believe we're gonna go through the brakes, see what we got, uh, 
We're gonna have a little mix matching stuff, but uh, I think we'll make it work. Um, I think other than that, uh, that'll be our next video, right, Sam? We hey, might take the roof off, put the seat in it tomorrow. Oh, we're gonna have to do that so we can get in there and check everything out. What we really need to show the list on the wall over there and be like, we just need a roof lather, repeat that. Oh, yeah, tomorrow. yeah. That was 2020s or oh. something, 2021s. 2021s list there. Yeah. Yep. Basically, everything there minus the body work is what we got to do on this car. Yeah, buddy. Check us out next time. Like, subscribe. Thanks for watching.